Thank you. To share with you tonight. You're still um, wearing a coat. I know. Okay. Yeah. Oh, it's happening. Sorry. <laughs> you lost my job. Okay. Um, tonight's theme is heroes, so I thought I'd start with something really frivolous, and I wrote something about my um, my fictional hero. Does anybody know Doctor Who? Yeah. 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 Right. Yeah. Good. Okay. Uh, Doctor Who, for those of you who don't know, it's the longest running science fiction um, series in the world. It's been going for 54 years, I think. And um, I wrote something today about my, the hero, my role model when I was a little boy, and sometimes my inspiration still. I'm a bit of a geek when I'm in a Doctor Who mood. Um, this, this is called Words of the Doctor. And it's, um, it's edited from things that he said over that 54 years period. Words of the Doctor. That's who I am. I can feel it. The turn of the earth. The ground beneath our feet spinning. I can feel it. Hurtling around the sun. And I can feel it. We're falling through space, you and me clinging to the skin of this tiny little world, and if we let go, don't forget me. <sighs> don't you forget me. If you could touch the alien sand, hear the cries of strange birds, watch them wheel in another sky, would that satisfy you? There are worlds out there where the sky is burning, the seas asleep, the rivers dream, people made of smoke, cities made of song. Somewhere there's danger, somewhere there's injustice, and somewhere else the tea is getting cold. Being alive right now is all that counts. An inventive, invincible species crawled up out of the mud, learned to walk, they survived flood, famine and plague, cosmic wars and holocaust. And now here they are, out among the stars, indomitable, ready to out-sit eternity. Kiss me. You know what they say? There's a first time for everything. And a last time. <laughs> 